The first meeting in Toulouse was organized in 1987. So we thought with uh, William, myself, that after 35 years, it was really necessary to change the leadership of Europicia. To be serious, we thought with uh, William that uh, it was necessary to inject uh, new blood, to have new ideas, new expectation, new views for the future of Europicia. That's the reason why we identify three fantastic leaders of the young representing the young generation of interventional cardiology. Nives, Thomas and Nicola. We really I wish them all the best for the future and I have no doubt about their full success in their new role of leadership of EuroPCR. Hello, my name is uh, Thomas Cuisset. I've been trained as interventional cardiologist in Marseille, France, and I also did my, my fellowship in Als Cardiovascular Center with William Wills. And today I'm the head of the interventional department in Marseille. Hello, my name is Nicolas Dumonte. I'm interventional cardiologist uh, in Clinique Pasteur, Toulouse in France. Uh, I was trained in uh, interventional cardiology in Rangueil University Hospital in Toulouse also. Uh, worked there during uh, several years as a senior interventional cardiologist and uh, had the opportunity to join uh, Clinic Pasteur uh, with uh, Jean Fajade and his group uh, in uh, 2016. And now uh, I'm, I'm working there. Um, my main areas of activity and expertise are of course coronary artery disease, but um, I mainly focus for uh, communication activities and also some scientific activities on structural heart disease treatments, mainly TAVI, uh, and now with development of, uh, of uh, new techniques uh, also on, on uh, transcatheter, tr uh, mitral valve or the tricuspid valve treatment. My name is uh, Nieves Gonzalo. I'm an interventional cardiologist working in Madrid. During my career, I have always tried to combine clinical activity, uh, education and research. Um, I had the luck of being trained into excellent centers. Uh, I did my PhD in the TRAC Center in Rotterdam, and I did my clinical training in Hospital Clinico San Carlos in Madrid, where I work uh, now. So at San Carlos, we receive fellows from uh, all over the world for training, so really education is a very important uh, part of our daily practice. Uh, and for me, it's one of the most uh, satisfying uh, activities we do. Apart from the clinical um, activity, I've always uh, been involved in the um, uh, intervention journal in the, as a deputy editor in this uh, fantastic group led by Davide Capodano. I can share an, um, yeah, um, an amusing memory about uh, my first participation to, to PCR, or EuroPCR, exactly. And uh, maybe, I hope, it will reassure our uh, youngest colleagues. So it was in 2009, my first EuroPCR participation. Uh, it was at that time, the first time uh, we had uh, a session dedicated to TAVI in EuroPCR. It was at Barcelona. It was called the TAVI Forum. And it was for me my first presentation in English, oral presentation at the international meeting. And I, I must confess that I was terrified. I was terrified. I was white in a, in a corner waiting to stand on the, on the podium, sweating. Uh, I had uh, tried to learn by heart my presentation, but forgot almost the, 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 all I, what I had to say. Um, so yeah, uh, year, uh, years after that, um, it's uh, finally a good memory, good experience, but uh, maybe yeah, it will be uh, reassuring for the, the youngest one uh, to see that uh, this can happen to, to any one of us. So along the years I've been uh, part of uh, EuroPCR with different roles. First time I went uh, to PCR, I was a fellow at the Truck Center and I uh, acted uh, as media driver. 
And after that, uh, coming back to Madrid, uh, I have the opportunity of uh, participating in Europe PCR with different roles as live case uh, operator, presenting, organizing sessions. Um, and I think that for me, really, Europe PCR has offered me the opportunity to interact with a lot of different people with different backgrounds from all around the world, different interests. Uh, this has really changed uh, the way I see interventions today and has been a really enriching experience. My first PCR experience was now more than 15 years ago when I was fellow in ALST Cardiovascular Center and I had to prepare the slides and the case for the, for the live cases during Euro PCR. And since then, I've been involved in many different PCR activities, including meetings, webinars, seminars, and other online education. And my very first experience and very special moment for me when I was fellow in Alst more than 15 years ago was the visit of Professor Marco in Alst who came to Halst just to review the cases selected for the live at this specific edition of Euro PCR. And at this specific moment, we spent just one day reviewing the case, discussing what will be the educational objective of this case. And I really understand that the P of PCR stands for preparation. I feel really honored to be part of the great team that makes uh, Euro PCR possible. And I'm um, uh, really privileged to work with these uh, people. I'm looking forward to continue working with my, uh, the two new directors, uh, Nicolas and um, Thomas, and of course, continue working with uh, Jan and William. So really looking forward to this uh, new experience. I've been medical director of the PCR webinars and more globally of uh, digital education for the last three years. And I know better understand the needs of the community. And I think as course director, our mission will be to balance the digital education with the, the education provided in physical meetings. And the main one is of course, Euro PCR. I'm really looking forward this great and huge mission we will have together with Nieves and Nicola. And of course, this huge mission comes with great responsibility. And I think the two key words will be the continuity, but also innovation and improvement. So participating to this uh, group of uh, Euro PCR uh, directors with Thomas Nieves, and of course, benefiting from the expertise, experience of Jean and William. Um, I'm really looking forward to uh, uh, helping the community, serving the mission of PCR through this, uh, through this meeting. And of course, um, I, I will try, and we will try to uh, uh, be innovative, uh, to bring some touches of uh, uh, new uh, formats, uh, new ways of uh, teaching, of sharing knowledge, practice, um, in order at the end to um, improve uh, our patient's care. We have big news, and now you know about it. We are thrilled with our three young colleagues joining the leadership of Europe ECR. They can count on our full support, Jean Fajadet and myself, in the, taking on this new task. And you can count, the entire community can count on their commitment and dedication to bring the value of Euro PCR course and other PCR courses to new heights. The future is bright. <laughs>